Ladies and gentlemen, this is Ingram Wrestling News' very own Brendan Ingram here with your first Ingram Wrestling News video today. So, I got news on Jim Cornette. I got yesterday's news on Jim Cornette saying Sonya Deville and Mandy Rose should be fired for a breaking K-5. So, this news was put out yesterday. It reads here that Sonya Deville thankfully escaped a very dangerous situation when a stalker invaded her home. A man named Philip Thomas the second, the third, no, Philip Thomas the third was stalking her online for years. And he planned his heinous attack for eight months. The bill was okay now. And at the time, the police reported she had a guest in her home. When it was revealed that Mandy Rose was that guest, things got very interesting. So the Deville and Rose were involved in a heated SummerSlam feud at the time. The two are long time friends, but they were also in a hair match at the biggest party of the summer. So this fucking jackass, this fucking blittering stupidity jackass idiot, Jim Cornette, went off about this on his Jim Cornette Experience podcast, more like Jim Cornette Experience Trash podcast, because that's what his podcast is, trash. Trust me, I know who Jim Cornette is. Cornette called for Rose and DeVille to be fired for breaking K-5. Obviously, his old school mentality called for it. Yeah, I already knew that. I already fucking knew it. Shit doesn't surprise me at all. Shit doesn't surprise me how much of a jackass he is. But then he backed off his initial point. A bit. So, this jackass, I'm going to call him the jackass Kim Cor Jim Cornette. So, the jackass Jim Cornette stated that WWE should have at least fined Rose in the bill for being caught together in that situation. Another alternative would be to wait about six months for the heat to die down and then fire him. He also chastised DeVille for taking Rose to the police to begin with. He had basically criticized DeVille for taking Rose to the police to begin with as he alluded that DeVille should have k 5 very a very well scary situation. Phones. Mandy Rose lives in Fort Lauderdale and she stays with Sonya Deville when she's in Orlando. Dodie has required their superstars to be in Orlando quite a lot in recent months. The, obviously, Dodie isn't going to find or fire Sonya Deville and Mandy Rose. They shouldn't. They didn't do anything wrong. Why would you fire Sonya Deville and Mandy Rose for breaking K-5? How does this even make sense? Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville deserve respect, and Jim Cornette is not giving that respect. Like I said before, I'm going to say it again. Jim Cornette is known for being an exposed asshole. He's known for commenting negative things about people and WWE wrestlers. What he doesn't like, what he doesn't see, he's known for commenting about them. He doesn't care about nobody's opinion but himself. So anyways, in a different era of professional wrestling, that would be a very good possibility. To me, it would be a very good negative possibility. That would be a, a, uh, a low possibility to me because it doesn't make sense. Regardless of the situation, some territory bookers fire wrestlers if they lost a bar fight. Not to mention if they were caught letting their hated enemy sleep in their guest room. So if you had any questions on that, please comment down in the section below. Folks, today I am going to be doing a full YouTube live, live stream talking all about Jim Cornette. And you are not going to believe what I found out about Jim Cornette. You're not going to want to miss my YouTube live stream because I'm going to put Jim Cornette on blast. I'm going to rant him and I'm going to talk a whole bunch of fucking shit about Jim Cornette. Because I'm going to really expose this man for who he really is. Which is 
nothing more. He is nothing more than a fucking pussy jackass. There you go. So, if you have any questions, comment down in the section below and comment your thoughts on Jim Cornette saying Sonya Deville and Manny Rose should be fired for breaking cave on. So, folks, do not miss my YouTube live stream. It's going to be, I'm going to be talking to you all all about Jim Cornette and what you need to know about Jim Cornette and how much of a fucking asshole he is. So, folks, I will see you on my second England Wrestling News video. My second wrestling news video, my second England Wrestling News video is going to be news. It's going to be news. On match announced for WWE Raw next week. So I'm going to have news on that. You're going to want to know that. And you know Raw is going to be illogical garbage next Monday. You know that's going to happen. You know they're always giving us illogical garbage every Monday night. So <sighs> See you on my next video, folks. And don't forget to tune in for my YouTube live stream. Because I'm going to talk to you all about Jim Cornette and what you need to know about. See you on the next one.